I think we all probably experience some anxiety from time to time in our lives, and it can come in varying degrees of intensity, lasting for various durations. It can come about very gradually or very suddenly. And this might come as a surprise to some, but I also find myself feeling anxious now and then. In fact, not so very long ago, I experienced a very intense and prolonged period of anxiety. And so I just wanted to share one of the ways that I've learned to deal with it. Something I've talked about before is how emotions are comprised of two elements. There are the thoughts that we have, and then there are the physical sensations that we feel in the body. And whenever I find myself feeling anxious, what I've noticed is the most pronounced sensation is a tightness in my chest, almost like there's a heavy weight on my chest and it feels as if my breathing is tight and restricted. And what I find most helpful is to simply take a few long, deep breaths. And so if there happens to be anyone watching who might be experiencing some anxiety at the moment, I invite you to do this with me now. So first of all, make sure that you're sitting comfortably with your back straight. Or if you prefer to lay down, that's fine. Just as long as your back is straight. And this helps to open up the chest, to open up the lungs, so that we can breathe much more easily and effortlessly, much more deeply. And if you want to close your eyes for this, you can, or keep them open, whichever you prefer. And also to do this at your own pace. You don't have to follow my breathing. Just relax and go at your own pace. And we're going to inhale very slowly and deeply in through the nose. And exhale out through the mouth. Ah. And again, breathing in deeply through the nose. And when you exhale, you're just letting go. Ah. We're not forcing the air out, we're just releasing it. And as you inhale, feeling the sensation of the breath, taking in all that life-giving oxygen, feeling as it passes in through the nose and fills the body. And as you exhale, just releasing any tension you might be holding in your body, just releasing and relaxing more and more with each out breath. Breathing in, giving all your attention to this moment right here and now. And breathing out, still noticing what is occurring in this moment, the various sounds and sensations. And if we're feeling any sensations in the body which we find uncomfortable or unpleasant, we simply breathe deeply into that space. And as we exhale, we release any tension from that area, allowing everything to just relax. And let's just take one more deep breath together, inviting in all that wonderful oxygen into our body, into the chest and all the way down to the belly. And relax and release. <sighs> letting go, letting everything be as it is. And whenever we're feeling anxious, we can do this, even if the circumstances are such that we cannot sit or close our eyes, we can still give attention to the breath, breathing in slowly and deeply, and releasing tension when we exhale. So, anxiety is essentially worry. It's essentially fear in regard to the future, what's going to happen next. And our mind, our imagination, can go wild with all kinds of ideas, all kinds of scenarios. Sometimes it can be very specific, other times it can be vague, and sometimes it's just the uncertainty that frightens us, the fact that we don't know what the future holds. And so our mind tries to fill in that uncertainty with some scenario, 
and oftentimes what we imagine might be something deeply unsettling. Whether or not it will actually come to pass in the way that we imagine, we don't really know. I've certainly noticed that most of the things I worry about never actually happen, or at least they don't tend to happen in the way that I imagine they will. And sometimes, every once in a while, the things I worry about do come to pass. But what I've also found is that much of the time it's often not as difficult or as painful as we might have imagined. And even when it is, we tend to get through it. Once we're actually faced with the reality of the situation, we tend to find that we have the strength to handle it. And I've said this before, that it's usually these kinds of challenging situations which reveal our strength to us that otherwise we might not have even realized we had. But as I said, most of what we worry about never even happens, and so we spend a great deal of time and energy agonizing over something which only exists in our imagination. And as a result, not only do we suffer needlessly, but we also miss out on this moment right here, right now, unable to enjoy life in the present moment. So again, whenever we're feeling anxious, we can attend to our breathing, giving all of our attention to the breath, noticing the sensation of it, and giving our attention to whatever else is taking place in that space, the sights, the sounds, the sensations, really giving our attention to what is right in front of us, to what is actually occurring right here in this present moment. Just observing everything, not judging, not interpreting, but just noticing. And we might notice that in this space, wherever we happen to be at the moment, that we are safe, regardless of all the various things we imagine might happen in the future, right now, in this moment, right here, we are perfectly safe. And we can relax and just breathe, and just to be fully present with where we are at the moment, with all that is occurring in this moment, just allowing the moment to be. Let the breath be your anchor. Whenever the mind begins drifting off into imagination, whenever you find yourself carried away into thought imagining some unpleasant future scenario, overwhelmed with worry, you can use the breath to guide yourself back to this moment and to keep your attention anchored here. As I've said, anxiety arises from thought, from imagination concerning the future. And so I would certainly recommend taking up some sort of regular mindfulness practice. This could be some traditional meditation practice, or simply just sitting outside and listening attentively to the birds, feeling the breeze against your skin or the sun on your face. Whatever happens to be occurring in that moment, to just give it your full attention. And to make it something that we commit to doing each day, just taking a few minutes each day to anchor our attention here in the present moment. Because as we make it a regular practice, it becomes much more natural and effortless. It becomes much easier to enter into that space, into that state of presence, and to remain there longer. If we simply set aside a few minutes each day to sit quietly and bring our attention to the present moment, then whenever we might happen to be feeling anxious, it will be much easier to anchor our attention here in the moment. Now, when we feel anxious, as I said, we may notice certain sensations in the body, and some of those sensations may be uncomfortable or unpleasant. And whenever we feel any sort of unpleasant sensation, our tendency is to try and get away from it, or to make it go away, or to distract ourselves from it. And in my experience, this doesn't seem to work. In fact, it often seems that the more I resist these sensations, the more they intensify. 
the sensation is arising in response to my emotional distress and any resistance I may have to that is also a kind of emotional distress or a kind of anxiety all its own it's the worry that what if this feeling doesn't go or what if it increases and of course the more I worry about it the worse it gets precisely because I'm worried about it and the more I struggle with it the more that feeling intensifies so what I've learned to do instead is just to relax with it, just to sit with it, just to simply allow it to be there. As uncomfortable as it may feel, it's not going to do you any real harm. It's just a sensation in the body. It's just some tension in the body. And the best thing we can do when there's any tension in the body is just relax. Any sort of resistance, any sort of struggle, if we're trying to fight with it or push it away or block it out, all of that just creates more tension. So to be able to just relax with it, allowing it to be there, breathing into it, keeping in mind that we're perfectly safe in this moment, keeping in mind that this tension in the body is not going to harm us, keeping in mind that it's not going to be there forever and that it will eventually pass all on its own but at the same time allowing it to be there just giving it space allowing it whatever time it needs to settle just being present with it just being patient with it just allowing it to be there for as long as it needs and the more we relax with it the more it decreases all on its own without any effort without any resistance to it without trying to force it in any way and so every time we begin to feel some anxiety coming on, we can just redirect our attention in this way, breathing deeply, relaxing any tension we're experiencing in the body, releasing any resistance we might be experiencing in the mind, and just allowing our attention to rest in this present moment. Thank you.